adventure. Um, we're going back into an area where I uh, actually haven't, haven't ever really camped back in here. I've been through here a little, you know, a few times, not very much. Um, way back beyond where I'm going to go, I've been back in there a really long, long time ago and camped there. But trying something new, kind of check this out. And uh, kind of see what we find. Anyway. Well, we're almost to the camp spot. Um, this just goes down here, I think, by the creek. I haven't, actually, actually, I haven't actually camped here before, but my brother did when he was up here hunting. So I thought I'd come check it out. But anyway, but well, we got a couple trees we got to cut out, and who knows, we might have a few more just before we get in there. So we'll get that taken care of right now. Well, the good thing is, <laughs> the plus is uh, I know nobody's been in here this year, so there's nobody camping down here. So we'll get the place we're shooting for. Anyway, get the stuff loaded back up and get out of here. Well, we made it to camp. <laughs> Had to cut a few trees, but uh, we're here. And it's actually a pretty cool spot. I like it. There's a creek right behind us. I'll just show you here in a bit. And uh, I don't know, it's nice and green. It's, I like it. A couple little metal grassy areas coming in. Not very big, but they're there. Um, so first thing I'm gonna do is give me something to eat because I didn't eat breakfast. <laughs> and I'm hungry and it's, I think I'm gonna fix me some bacon and eggs. <laughs> so I'm gonna get started on that.
finally getting camp all set up. Finished my my breakfast lunch. <laughs> I think I had breakfast at two o'clock. But uh, anyway, this is at the end of the road. Um, it actually comes in right there, and then I'll loop back out here. But anyway, this is it, and you got the Jeep, turtleback trailer set up with the rooftop tent, and a nice little fire here. Um, it's a beautiful area, really, really beautiful area. I, you always wonder, my brother said it was really cool. He said, yeah. So anyway, I was like, all right, I'm going to go check it out. But anyway, just kind of go around here, back to here, kind of give you an idea what it looks like. But uh, anyway, let's take a walk down to the... Uh, the water down here which is pretty cool a lot of water running right now there's still I, when I was coming over the top there's still some spots where there was some snow on the edges of the road and stuff mostly gone but uh, still a little bit yeah this is pretty cool I like it I'll have to come back here for sure yeah this is this is cool the crazy thing is is there's a fire that went through this area Probably, I don't know, two, three years ago, three or four years ago. And for some reason, it, it, there's some pockets. I mean, we're kind of on the edge of it, but this spot didn't. But you can see up on the, the hill, it burned up there. And you go over that, that way very far, and it's burnt. So luckily, it left this, but this is beautiful. I mean, you can see some, back over there, you probably see some white over there, some snow over there still. But yeah, nobody's been in here yet this year. I had to cut out, I think, four trees. But uh, it's kind of, it's all right because as soon as I pulled in, I was like, oh, sweet, nobody's been here. Now one of the next thing we're gonna do is get some firewood. So we have some firewood for a fire tonight. But yeah, that's it. Well, found me yourself a tree and cut it all up, brought it over here, found one that wasn't laying on the ground, so hopefully it'll be dry enough that it'll burn good, which if they're standing they generally are. Um, I'm gonna hang out here for a little bit and just enjoy this beautiful area that area that I'm in. And uh, here in about another hour or so, we'll have dinner. Anyway, I think probably get a fire going here. But uh, this is awesome. The weather's like really nice. It is a little overcast. We've had some sun break through, but it's a little overcast. I don't, not much of a chance of rain, but we, we could get a sprinkle. But uh, no, this is awesome. I like the spot. dinner time I guess I will uh, fix me up a, some burger and bacon and add some other stuff to it but anyway I'm gonna get going on this
Yep, I think that's pretty much ready. Grab some lettuce. Well, I forgot the buns for the burger, so I'm improvising. <laughs> Which, this will be really good. Well, got dinner out of the way. Got all the dishes done, everything cleaned up. Just gonna hang out for the evening and gonna hang out around the fire, just kind of relax and just enjoy being here. It's pretty awesome. And then, uh, I don't know. This tomorrow morning, <clears throat> I gotta kind of get headed back down. It's um, Father's Day on Sunday, tomorrow Saturday. And I gotta get back down there so I can spend some time with my uh, son. So anyway, this is a quick trip, but I'm glad I came. This is awesome. I mean, it's a cool place. It's just nice to be in the mountains. And man, the weather's, it is a little overcast, but the weather's really good. It's not cold. And right now there's no wind. So it's it's beautiful. It's, it's, it's a nice night. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of it. And then we'll hit the, uh, I'm in the tent and go to sleep and get up in the morning and kind of get going and try to get headed out of here. So, anyway, you know, that turtleback trailer has turned out to be super nice. The more I use it, I've been able to tweak it over time and add a few things and just, and just kind of adjust it all. It makes it super easy to get out of town quick. This is kind of a last minute deal. Yesterday I just decided I was going to come. I wasn't going to because of Father's Day, but I was like, you know what, I'll just come a little, go a little closer than where I normally go and come up here and just enjoy the one night and, and then uh, go back down, but I'm glad I did, but kind of got that all, all figured out where it just uh, basically put water in it, checked everything, pretty much had everything ready, had to buy some food, throw some clothes in, and throw all my camera gear in, and then uh, I'm ready to go. It didn't take much time at all, I noticed that was the same. <clears throat> the same with the last trip. Pulled it out there and got it all ready, and it's like we're already pretty much ready. Just got to get a few more things in here, you know, food and clothes and stuff like that. But uh, no, I'm I'm re really enjoying it. So anyway, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of this evening, and before I and then climb into bed, I guess. Nice beautiful morning today. Kind of late in bed. Had the uh, screens just open so I could see and just laid there and listened to the, the birds chirping and kind of watching the sun come through the trees. And like, oh, it's going to be a nice sunny day. Which, yeah, there's no overcast today. It's, it's beautiful. Nice and sunny. Um, so, anyway, it's a good time to be up here. But uh, I think I'm going to get the tent all packed up and put away and kind of start getting things going and kind of go from there. Well, I'm all packed up, ready to go, so we're going to get out of here. But it is a, it is a fun trip. Kind of a really uh, beautiful place to camp, so I'll, I'm sure I'll be back here somewhere along the way. But anyway, we're going to get out of here. <laughs>
So, headed home now. Um, if you liked it, liked the adventure we, we had today, uh, like and subscribe and, and uh, leave a comment if you like. And uh, we'll see you on the next one.